Bully by Jennifer Sattler Bully lived in a pond full of lilies and he wanted the lilies all to himself. Hey you! shouted Bully. Oh hello! said the snail. Have you tasted these lilies? They are delicious! Well, they're delicious and they're mine! Oh, what a glorious scent, said a nearby dragonfly. It's just heavenly. Hey you! Get out of my pond! But I was just enjoying these marvellous smelling lilies, said the dragonfly. Their smell is the most marvellous, marvellous and mine. Hey bee, stop touching those flowers, they're mine. But these lilies love it when I tickle them, said the bee. No, croaked Bully. Those delicious, marvellous smelling tender lilies are mine. Everybody out! And he meant everybody, even the smallest fly. Bully finally had the lilies to himself. He had made himself a crown. He ate until his tummy ached. He slept on a new pile of lilies every night. Soon there was only one lily left. I'll keep this for myself, said Bully, to no one. I don't want anyone to smell it or touch it or taste it. It's mine. So he sat on it. The bee flew in. Excuse me, Bully, said the bee, but you're squashing that flower. So what are you going to do about it, said Bully. The bee had an idea. And then, with Bully gone, the lilies started to come back. Bully moved on to another pond, only this one was mostly just mud. Hmph, Bully croaked, all mine. It's easy to see that Bully is not a kind bullfrog, but what does it mean to be kind? Is it hard to do? Do you need special tools or superpowers? Nope, being kind is rather easy. If you like to draw, maybe you could draw a giant bug or a pretty flower and give it to someone who's having a hard day. You're getting bigger every day, so maybe your pants are too short. You could give them to someone who's smaller than you. Or maybe you have a toy that you haven't played with for a while. I bet there's someone little who would love to play with it. There might be a time when you see someone being unkind to another person. You could walk up to that person who is being treated poorly and say, Hey, let's go play over there. That could be all it takes to make the person feel not so alone and to remind them that although there are bullies out there, there are a lot more kind people and you are one of them. Try this next time you're with your mom or dad or your favourite grown-up. Smile at everyone you see. You'll start to see faces smiling back at you, like flowers bursting open. Who knows, it might be like being in a whole new pond full of lilies.